Yeah, hey everybody, this is Ian from Mindful Marketplace, and in this video I'm going to show you the exact step-by-step -step, uh, process for embedding a Podia product on an external website. In this case, we're going to use WordPress. So you're going to take the product. In this case, we're going to select this one because of the, the site that we're actually uh, going to be embedding this product on is germane or relevant to this sort of empath, you know, spiritual seeker uh, sort of uh, website or platform. So all you want to do is go to embed course from the options in the, uh, you know, in the, in the product, actually these three dots, you want to click on that and there's share course and embed course. You want to actually, for this process, pick embed course. And it gives you three options in the format, link, button, and card. Link looks like this below. Button looks like a button. And card is really the one that we want because it has the, the richest appearance in media. It just it, it's, it's the highest converting of the bunch. It's the prettiest and it's the most enticing aesthetically for your audience. We're going to go to embed code. We're going to copy that. Now we're going to go into the dashboard of a WordPress site that gets a fair amount of traffic in the sort of spiritual seeker niche. We're going to go to appearance, customize. Now this is somewhat theme dependent. Different themes have different uh, you know, settings for this, but you can do this with a hook. You can do it with a widget, but in this case, I'm going to use the additional content tab and we're going to go to post and this is where we have all these hooks built into this theme. You should see this here refresh. Let's go, let's add one here. You don't want to like go completely crazy with this before post. I am going completely crazy with this now just because I want you to see this. But when I'm done this video, I'll remove a couple of these uh, instances of this particular widget. Actually, it's not a widget, it's the embed code. All right, let's go back to the site. Let's do it like this, so we get out of the back end of WordPress. And as you can see, here up top, let's pick a random post. And as you can see at the very top of the site, you have that Podia product. I don't know what happened there. Here it is again here. And I did go crazy. It's too crazy, right? Here's the post. Here's another Podia embedded product that I had uh, put there before. As you can see, this is sort of overkill. It's not sort of overkill. It's radical overkill. But this is how you embed a Podia product on a external uh, URL, specifically in this case using WordPress uh, hooks or slots or widgets. Again, this is somewhat contingent upon your uh, WordPress theme. Some themes don't have this level of of availability of uh, you know hooks or spots, but you can you, you can install a plugin if you don't that will that will essentially facilitate the same availability. All right, so what I would do actually is go back and I would delete some of those so it's not obnoxious um, but yeah it's pretty simple you can do the same thing in ghost you can do the same thing in, in an html site and uh yeah it's really effective i've gotten a lot of uh, sales and clicks and signups simply by taking a podia embedded widget and then pasting it into the theme or the template on just about any kind of 
uh, you know, niche sort of community that you can think of. All right, so hopefully that helps. If you have any questions about this process, feel free to ask. Thanks so much.